Hey guys, the big day is here. Apple has just released iOS 13.0 to everyone worldwide, and you can download it right now for your iPhone, for your iPad. If you wish to do so, you want to head on over to settings, general software updates, and you'll see iOS 13.0 populate on your device just like so. Now, the download is approximately two and a half to three gigs, depending on your device. So I highly recommend before updating to iOS 13 to watch my guide on how to prepare your device before the software update and make sure you're connected to Wi-Fi and a power source before you update to iOS 13. And Apple also released iPadOS 13.0 as well as watchOS 6 to everyone worldwide. And iOS 13 just brings so many improvements to iOS and your iPhone. You're gonna love this software update. If you want a breakdown of everything that's new, I'll have down below a playlist of all my beta coverage so you can see all of the new features that iOS 13 will be bringing to your iPhone, iPad, and all of your Apple products as well with watchOS and tvOS, which all of these softwares, big day for Apple, have been released just now. Now, Apple brings dark mode to the iPhone with iOS 13. I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys will love and enjoy this new feature if you haven't updated to iOS 13. This is one of the big features that Apple is bringing to the platform. There's also a ton of camera and photo app improvements here as well with great tools to edit your videos as well as photos. Apple also brings signing in with Apple. So a third party application requests for you to sign in in order to get some access. This will help you protect your personal data by using a random email to actually log into third party applications and things like that to help protect your data. Very awesome feature there as well. The App Store now received the Apple Arcade, which is live. This device here is running iOS 13. I've been trying the Apple Arcade. This is going to be live on your iPhone as of today. Apple Arcade is a subscription service for games where you can sign up. I think it's $5.99 a month and you can play over 100 titles and these are exclusive titles. You do get a month free for Apple Arcade. Great improvements to Map. Reminders application has been entirely redone. Great improvements to Siri. Any mode and Memoji stickers and improvements to Memoji are across the board with support on all devices, including haptic touch and long press for all devices as well. So this is just such a major update. I highly recommend updating to iOS 13. Again, any emoji and Memoji improvements and stickers were brought to every single iPhone across the board along with the long press and haptic touch. We have improvements to Apple CarPlay and augmented reality. The mail application also contains a ton of improvements. Big updates to the notes application. Again, if you want an entire breakdown of everything that's new with iOS 13. I'll link down below my playlist of all the features that are new with iOS 13, but this is just a quick glance. Safari received a major update. Now Safari has a download manager. I mean, once you install iOS 13, this is going to feel like your iPhone is an entirely new device. I highly recommend it. Again, if you're looking to update tonight, you go ahead and watch my prepare for iOS 13 video. There I give you a breakdown on how to uh, get ready before updating to this software because this is a big software update. As I mentioned, this software comes in at approximately two and a half gigs. So you're gonna to wanna to update when you're connected to a power source and Wi-Fi maybe overnight. And you're just gonna love your iPhone after this. Once you activate that dark mode for the first time on your iPhone with iOS 13, you're gonna love the experience because it's just something entirely, entirely new. And all the new features that Apple brings to the iPad OS and watch OS are just mind blowing. As I mentioned, just across the board, a ton of improvements to your iPhone iPhones and iPads. Now, iPad OS just makes the iPad feel like an entirely separate experience. I highly recommend that software update as well. And Watch OS 6. If you haven't watched my full review on Watch OS 6, this has been released today as well. I highly recommend you check out that video in the description to learn more about Watch OS 6. And just a big day, big day for Apple. iOS 13 is currently live. I hope you guys enjoy the video, enjoy the software update. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys real soon. Peace.